Hello everyone, it's Tom from Story PvP Mode, a YouTube channel. Uh, I thought I'd do a quick video because I've been experiencing this problem and I know a lot of other people have asked for a fix. Uh, this is for the Radian AMD, uh, sorry, let's start again, the AMD Radian HD 7000 series graphics cards. I own a 7950 myself so I have been experiencing the problem and with a recent patch about four weeks ago I think it started with League of Legends there was uh, tearing on the screen graphical flickers, graphical errors of all sorts um, how that's been corrected for me is been installed in 13.2 beta drivers in the description you'll see how to do that um, but essentially it will be a case of uninstalling what you have at the moment uh, going to your downloads and installing the 13.2 beta drivers now that will fix the in-game problems there is an additional problem though where if you're recording your game you will not be able to provide you know you, you will not be able to provide the same quality as in game because you get a flickering now in the description there's an unlisted video of me um, chatting over a game with uh, with this flickering. Now just to show, that's just to, if you want to click to see what problem that is whilst recording, uh, go and check that out. The software I'm using is Open Broadcaster Software. There's no reason to pay for you know things like XSplit. This by is by far the best in my opinion out anywhere for streaming or for YouTube or for however you want to use it um, so you know go and download this instead <laughs> but we're not here to talk about that I'm just going to show you how to um, set it up so that you don't get that flickering and this is how I've done it I've downloaded uh, open broadcaster software which is from obsproject.com and how I've set it up is that I set it so that it records screen capture, so the software capture, it's recording my monitor at the moment. Now this will cause the flickering still. You'll see the flickering. Even though you won't see any flickering in game, when you come to actually do your watch your MP4 back or however you recorded it, you'll see that flickering still. And it's so annoying and this is just the solution to that. Um, so what you're going to do is you're going to have the monitor and software capture set up if you want to. If you're streaming, you're going to want to have this up. So we've done that. That's set up. It's just recording my screen. There's nothing. It's very easy to set up. We just do whatever. Anyway, moving on. Uh, so the game capture you want to set up is, as it looks at the moment, is you just add scene. And it's League of Legends, and I've set it to one and two. So uh, one gets you the screen, and two will get you a blank screen, or it looks blank at the moment. Now the properties of this is that this is actually recording from a screen that's not at the moment up. Um, it doesn't yet exist. That's because the client in League of Legends is um, a bit strange. I don't know the technical reasons for it, but it doesn't recognise itself in a window like, say, Diablo 3. So, as it stands at the moment, it is blank. You're looking at a blank screen, so sorry about that. Um, so what we're going to do now is we're going to start a game, play. We're just going to do a, uh, a tutorial to show it. Um, and I'll do like a few minutes, because if you're like me, you've been experiencing this problem over... Um, every two minutes it seems to happen every two every two and a half minutes but at the moment so the game is now sort of active properties it's recognized that League of Legends is now there so you see how it's changed to League of Legends TM client this is now so <clears throat> again you're looking at a blank screen now you've got the monitor up now gone into League of Legends and Welcome if I was to play this to for one or two minutes, 
you'll see a flickering. We're now going to press 2, which is the game capture. And now you are seeing the game as game capture. Now, the difference is, if you play this out like it is now, you won't get any flickering or, you know, constant flickering. It will just literally play the game as it should be played. Um, so I'm just going to mess around for uh, two minutes, say up to three minutes, because you'll definitely see the flickering by then. Um, now I'll do four minutes. We'll do uh, four minutes and, you know, just show you what um, the problem should appear, or the problem, you shan't see the problem. Um, I am going to do an additional video whereby I'm going to show a full 30-40 minute game using just the game client because I think that will just sort of allay anyone's fears and say well you can't really do the, show the problem in 5 minutes um, so yeah there will be a 45 minute or so one game to demonstrate the um, to demonstrate it for me the reason why I've set up two um, Agreed. Two sort of, uh, sorry, two um, scenes is because I know some people are streamers, so this is certainly gonna help you if you're streaming. My aim is steady. because of course you're gonna need that second scene set up. Um, it works almost identically to or very similar to how you would in other streaming software. Press on. But at the moment I'm more focused on. You just YouTube, so it doesn't really bother me that much. And we certainly don't want to die in a demo. So yeah, at the moment, it's just me talking uh, through it just to uh, fill the video. My, My gold's going up immensely. Anyway, um, I've done a uh, Diablo 3 videos I actually wanted to start because I'm brand new to uh, League of Legends uh, I had wanted to show me from the start leveling like an idiot's guide to League of Legends but because I couldn't actually do um, I, the quality was excellent of the video it was just this flickering and I didn't feel it was very good and people just wouldn't want to watch it so for me this is uh, a solution to now that I can go and record uh, games. So for me it's great, hopefully it will work for you and hopefully it will fix the problems that you're Agreed. having if you are a 7000 series owner. Like I said, absolute disclaimer, 7950 is what I have. It's 3 gig right, it's HIS uh, Radeon. I can't guarantee this is going to work for every one. Um, so if you're a 7970 it might not work for you but it's worked for me hopefully it will work for you um, I think we'll get to the point now we'll go to five minutes and then I'll uh, stop the video but I will put in the description and hopefully put in the video somewhere um, the link to the full game in game client mode so that you you know just to to show you so that I think is going to be about it. Um, if you'd like to subscribe or like or you know comment on this video, I will try and help. But you know I'm not a tech techie person. I'll just try to solve it myself. Um, so I will help. The best people to speak to is of course League of Legends, Lodger thing, Lodger uh, support ticket. I mean they're certainly they're very helpful. Um, they are trying to resolve the problem still because it's still an ongoing problem. You want some of this. Um, it's still not technically fixed. This is just a, a workaround, if you will. But I know there are people that are probably just getting frustrated now with streaming and, and things like that. So yeah, this is just, just for these uh, people. The 13.2 beta drivers, I'll put in the description on how to... Um, just basically a written thing on how to uh, uninstall, load, uh, inst uninstall your current drivers, install the beta, and then away you go.
So if you're just using it solely for the uh, purposes of just playing the game as you want, um, then yeah, I'll just uh, I'll leave it at that. Um, I think that's about it. Like I said, if you if this is you'd like to see me play more games, um, although this isn't actually me playing yet, <laughs> it's more just uh, showing the thing. But yeah, I'm gonna start doing some, some League of Legends um, videos. Hopefully, you'll uh, be kind enough to maybe watch one or two. I don't want to persuade anyone, of My course. Um, but yeah, if you like, comment, and subscribe to that, and or comment and just say, you know, if it's fixed your problem, that would be great. And just pass it on to other people, because that will really help, you know, Agreed. others. Um, I think that's it. Um, I'm going to just leave the game client. I mean, the streaming software is still new to me, so if I press 1 now, I think you should now see my screen, which you do, and yeah, that's it. Okay, so that's it. Done the video. Going to put this on the forums, um, hopefully help a lot of people, I hope. Um, if it doesn't, you contact League of Legends, they are working on it, their support's great. Um, that's it. That's it. I can't think of anything else to say. Okay. Thank you very much. Uh, thanks for watching. Um, hopefully you'll see me in the future.